We're here today in Southall, where one of the largest Nagar Kirtans outside of India is taking place today. And what are we celebrating on Singh? We're celebrating Vasakhi today. Join us on BOS Vlogs as we take you through the Southall Nagar Kirtan. as we celebrate Vasaki today and go throughout the whole of the Nagar Kirtan. A lot of food stores, a lot of uh, uh, waffling, I don't know what to say. Today the barbecue side was just left from Park Avenue Gurdwara. So the Sevadar spent all day, all week basically, <coughs> decorating and getting the barbecue side truck ready. And now you can see it's really beautiful the way they've done all the flowers and the frames and everything. That's all custom built by the Sevadars here. So now, the Panj Piyare, so the five beloved Singhs, have come and they've sat on the Palki side and that's making its way to Havlok Road Gudwara, Guru Nanak Road Gudwara, the big Gudwara. And then from there, Guru Sahib Ji is going to come onto the float and then that's when the Nagar Kirtan will start. And we'll go all the way around South and come back. So, yeah, looking forward to that. Good turn, Singh. Okay. Is this your, this is your first Nagar Kirtan? Uh, it's the second one. Yeah. The first one was in November last year, but Obviously, for a few years it was cancelled because of COVID. Yeah. So this is the first one in April time that I'm going to. Yeah. So looking forward to it. First Vasaki Nagarkitan. First Vasaki Nagarkitan, how do you do? What's your expectation? What are you excited for? Uh, I'm excited just to see excitement the song. You see everyone's really excited. The food, obviously, is yeah. <laughs> quite nice. Seeing everyone just happy, really, and uh, kind of listen to the Kitan and spreading that love of good morning. I see all the Sevadars are here excited. Looking forward to it. Why how long has the Seva been going on the park? It's side? like uh, two, three days. Yeah. Around. Yesterday night they started. Yeah. Today, today morning it, it finished. Preparation wise, we made the structure of the park like Gurbani, Gurbani Pankti boats yeah. and uh, all the which high, internal which high, yeah. outside paint and all. Look how amazing this is. We're in the middle of London and uh, look, we've locked off the whole of South Wall. Things like even doing the traffic management themselves, you know, this is what I envision Castle and Arch to be like. I should cut that bit out. Can't say that. Can't say that. <laughs> Do you know what is happening here? I don't know what's happening. What's happening? So, so this is an annual procession, so it's called the Nugget Keaton. So basically what happens is we go from place to place singing the praises of God, singing our holy scripture from our Guru. So at the moment we're actually closing the roads off. So this is a palki, so the, the, the vehicle can go to the starting point, which is Guru Nanak Road. And then we're gonna go across the whole, around South Hall, and close all the roads. There's free food, there's singing of praises. Well, there's there's today, yeah? yeah, it's happening today. Every, every, every year happens. It's been canceled a couple of years. So yeah, if you're around, feel free to soak it all in, get some free food, talk to some people, it'd be great. So thanks so much for holding up. I'll let you go, thank you. Behind us is the London fire engine with the Shan Sahib on there. The Balki Sahib has just arrived at Gurdwana Road, Gurdwara. And now the Bant Bade Sahib are going to go inside and Maharaji is going to come and bless the Sangat with their darshan. So carry on watching as we show you the rest of the Nagar Kirtan. So as the Panch Piyari come into the Gurdwara side, their feet are being washed by the Sevadars. This is a sign of utmost respect given to them. And it's humility from the Sevadar who gets to do the Seva of washing the other Guru Sikhs' feet. So while we're waiting to see Guru Granth Sahib Ji, we're looking forward to see members of the ambulance service and the firefighters who serve the community so well. And this links to and reminds us of an amazing Guru Sikh called Pai Kanaya Ji. At the time of Guru Gobi Singh Ji, when they were fighting with the Khalsa against the Mughals and the Hill Raji, the Hill Kings, Pai Kanaya Ji was also there. But they weren't fighting on the battlefield, they were there to serve the injured and wounded soldiers water. And one time the Sikhs saw Pai Kanaya Ji serve the Mughals water. And this frustrated them because they'd fought so hard to defeat the Mughals, to injure the Mughals, that many of their Sikh brothers had lost their lives, sacrificing themselves in this battle. And then they see somebody who's serving the enemy water. 
On another occasion, a well-known fierce Mughal soldier was defeated by the Sikhs with so much effort, so much difficulty. And Bhai Ganeya Ji even gave them water when they were injured. And what happened was the Mughals actually took that fierce soldier back to their base and they nursed them back to health. And when the Sikhs found out about this, they were so angry that they thought, we're going to have to complain to Guru Gobi Singh Ji now. And they went to Guru Gobi Singh Ji and they said that, who is this person that keeps serving the enemy water? Are they a spy? They tell us, who are they? And Guru Gobi Singh Ji being the Antar Jami, meaning the inner knower of our hearts and our minds, they knew the internal state of Bhai Kanaya Ji. And they thought, let's show the Sikhs that there are different spiritual levels. So to go along with this play, this Leela, Guru Gobind Singh Ji, with a bit of Biras, warrior spirit, said to the Sikhs, they said, go bring Bhai Kanaya Ji to me. And the Sikhs then went to the battlefield where Bhai Kanaya Ji was serving still. And they said to Bhai Kanaya Ji, you're going to come with us right now because Guru Gobind Singh Ji has summoned you. They grabbed his arm, took them to Guru Gobind Singh Ji. And Guru Gobind Singh Ji asked them, they said, we've heard that you've been serving the enemy soldiers, the Mughals, with water. But Bhai Kanaya Ji said, no Guruji, I haven't. Guruji said, that it must be the hill raja, the hill kings that you've been serving with water then. And Bhai Ganeya Ji said, No Guruji, I haven't. And Guruji said, it must have been the Sikhs then, our own Sikhs that you were serving with water, those who were wounded. And Bhai Ganeya Ji said, No Guruji, I haven't. And the Sikhs overhearing this, they were getting so angry in their mind because they had seen with their own eyes that Bhai Ganeya Ji was serving the Mughals, the hill raja and the Sikhs with water. How could they be lying to Guru Gobind Singh Ji standing right in front of them? And Guruji said that, who were you serving water to then? And Bhai Kanaya Ji said that, Guruji, I was serving you. That wherever I look, whatever I see, I only see you. And Guru Gobind Singh Ji explained to the Sikhs that this was the spiritual state of Bhai Kanaya Ji. That they saw that light of Guruji, saw that light of Vaheguru inside everybody. And they said, don't ever say anything to Bhai Kanaya Ji again. When we listen to this Saki, let us take inspiration that those people around us, those people we see that are in need, that are suffering, let's serve them with love by seeing that light inside of them. So let's go back downstairs while we wait for Maharaj to come down. So Paji, we're here at the Vasaki Nagar Kirtan. Can you just tell me a bit about yourselves? Sure. Uh, my name is Major Dunjinder Singh uh, and I'm part of the British Army. Uh, really proud to be here. Um, Celebrating Vasaki alongside the community um, and especially in this group where I can bring my uh, the organization I work for as well and represent Sikhs and the armed forces today. Um, you know, uh, it makes me extremely proud. Uh, I'm from this community, I'm from Southall, so for me it's extra special uh, meeting friends and family as well. Okay. And I see you've got your whole unit is out here. Hanji, so uh, we've got a bit of a tradition going from a number of years where we what we have is called a guard of honor. Um, so when Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj comes down the steps, we normally line the steps marshalling uh, and paying our respects in that way. So it's an army tradition, but it's great that we can mix in the army traditions with our Sikh uh, culture uh, and faith as well. Uh, check out Paji's page as well, Sikh Defence Network, and uh, support them guys as well. Thank you so much. As the Sangha are waiting for Maharaj to come, you can hear in the background, Santa Maharaji's Kirtan is playing in the background and all the Sangat are having a really, really good time and everyone's full of joy and we can't wait for the Nagar Kirtan to start. So Santa Isha Singh Ji Maharaj were one of the greatest saints of the 20th century. We will put the link of the podcast below about Santa, Santa Isha Singh Ji Maharaj and all of the great work that they did within their life. And actually, it was at this Guru Kar that Santa Maharaj did some of their first divans in Southall, in London, in UK when they came here. King of Kings is coming out now from Guru Nanak Road Gurdwara and they are preceded by horns, drums, the Ran Singh, Nagara. The Panch Piyare precede them. Singh Sahib Gani Rivel Singh Ji uh, from uh, Satchkhar City Harmandar Sahib Ji. 
are holding Maharaji and bringing them towards the Palki side. Nagarkirtan is going to be led by the Panj Pyare, the five beloved ones. And these represent the first five Sikhs who received Amrit from Guru Gobi Singh Ji. So we have Pai Daya Singh Ji, which means compassion. Then we have Pai Dharam Singh Ji, which means righteousness, duty. Then we have Pai Himmat Singh Ji, meaning courage. Then we have Pai Mohkim Singh Ji, which means unwavering, firm, determined. And then we have Pai Sahib Singh Ji, which means master. So once someone takes on all the qualities of the first four Panj Pyare, then they become the master, the former Vaigur. As you can see, um, we're here today uh, in front of Maharaj's Palki uh, doing the Sikh martial art Gatka. That's called a chakkar. than Gatka, but this is just like our the star, just like just like everything Maharaj has given us, Gatka is part of us. Gatka is as important as anything we do in Sikhi. So I think I believe it's just as strong martial art today in today's day and age. Without the weapon even you can protect yourself. It's not just that you need the shastas to protect yourself. The discipline that comes with the martial arts, the training that goes into it just as relevant as it was in Guru Maharaj's times as today. 
So interesting fact, this road used to be called Havelock Road and now the Sikhs petitioned to get the name changed to Guru Nanak Road and the council allowed it, so now it's called Guru Nanak Road. How amazing is that? We are at Hazur Sahib yeah. and um, so Pai Sahib Ji, Pai Sahib Pai Mahindra Singh Ji Hone have uh, started the uh, car seva there. And uh, so over, year, over the years, the, um, the actual fresco work has, has deteriorated. The uh, committee of Hazur Sahib of Asla Wajji wanted to actually come back to do the Kar Seva, to restore, to do the restoration project there. So yeah, it was a good experience last uh, last couple of weeks ago. It's very good. And, and Babaji's been involved a lot in also the restoration at City Darbar Sahib as well, right? Correct, Tanji. So last year in March 2022, restoration of the inside of the uh, Darbar Sahib is being done now. So those fresco works, Babaji are beautifully restoring those works. Yeah. And even though the plates are going to go on top of the, uh, the, the fresco, mm. uh, they're being restored because, you know, this is Maharaj's. This is Maharaj's house, and Guru Guru Kakar. And you know, we won't see those fresco works in our lifetime again. But all Maharaj's Kakar, Maharaj will see them. God will see them, and so um, that's been done. The first plates have gone on on the first kumti there inside. Um, so it was an experience. It's fantastic. It's very so lucky to be part of that um, project as well, and and Karseva. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. And for anyone who doesn't know, this is on Karting to Dad. <laughs> thank you. He might mistake as his brother. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. You better not put this on. Apne bolu yo sari saas sangat no bobo bada nya. Te a jadi Ronakur jadi nagar ki itar nele andiya South Hall de vich. Dekhe man bada khush ho raha. Te jethe asi raha raha ho the matlab apni community bhog ata. Main Tilbury to. Te na. Daughter, no, carry this. Give that. I see. See, can you man, happy? Or be a part of community. Or there, no one. As if Kalle is saying, or there, eh? The very happy. Or there, no. Why Guruji ka Khalsa? Why Guruji ki Fate? What is Vasaki? Do you know what Vasaki is? Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure either. So Vasaki is when Guru Gobind Singh started the Khalsa. Do you know what Khalsa is? Yes. So basically, um. Like for the full go to Govind Singh Ji, like you had to amrit shak. Um, that means like you can't like cut your hair. You're not a meat eater, and basically you're a child of Guru Govind Singh Ji. Yeah, really good. Yeah, exactly. Yes, yeah. so you become a when you when you take amrit, you become a child of Guru Govind Singh Ji. And you need to do the panch kakar. What are the panch kakar? If you, if you don't mind me asking. Uh, the panch kakar are basically uh, kashera, karpan, ganga, kes, and what was the last one? Akara. So the famous thing about South of Nagadgir then is the hundreds of stalls that are here for miles and miles on end. Um, you'll just look around right now and uh, you'll find every single form of delicacy you can think of. Cake, samosa, I don't know, what do we see there? Sandwiches, right? Everything, everything's here. So come, let's try, let's try and find something nice to eat. What do you fancy Gurtan? Because Gurtan is a bit picky, yeah? Anything. You're vegan. And yeah. Anything. Well, also, you're, glu you're gluten-free. No, I'm not gluten-free. You're not gluten-free? No, no, no. You're, so you're, you're vegan and organic? Try and be a bit healthy, innit? Yeah, healthy, yeah. But so, I'll probably be having chips in a bit. So, so it's, it's funny, right. actually, this morning we had brought here at Gurmi Singh's Nanniji's house and uh, Gurtan's plate was like proper dry, no butter, <laughs> no nothing. So, so. we're just at Gurmi's Nanniji's house now. And what are we having, Gurtan Singh? Sabki and Prota, I think. You lift your plate up. Actually, yours is a bit <laughs> vegan. Gurmi, <laughs> you lift yours up. <laughs> Last breakfast in the morning. Right. Looks like there's some chips here. Should we have a look at what's here? So over here, the Sangat are serving Babri uh, Jad. So, Baji, have you got any message to say to the Sangat on Vasaki? Uh, happy Vasaki to everyone. Keep supporting uh, uh, yes, uh, Punjabis. Uh, that's, uh, that's what I have to say. <laughs> so what is it that you got there today? I've got Papri Jad, uh, we've got Dhania, we've got uh, Chole in it, we've got uh, crunchy stuff. Yeah. Oh, is it okay if we try some? Thank you so much. Thank you, G. Would you like one as well? There you go. So, our famous connoisseur, Hong <laughs> Kong Singh. What do, you, what do you think of it? Tell me how, how does it taste. Let's try it together, Gary, yeah? It's funny, before the guy said, support the All right, come, let's try it, yeah? Mm. That's proper, isn't it? Proper, proper, proper what? Nice and fresh. 
you can tell they made the pop be fresh right there, isn't it? Really soft, really crispy. A lot of the, you can look, if you look at the tonia in here, proper fresh stuff. Yeah, really, really tasty. It's quite tangy, actually. Yeah. It's a bit of a tangy twist. It's really nice, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, but this people would pay like money for this. Yeah, like in restaurants. restaurants, we pay five pound fifty for a plate of coffee jot. Yeah. And here, look at the beauty of Gudumada Jizanga. It's so amazing, actually. This always some baby once told me this. Uh, one of my first Langer gifts, then she goes, Gudumada Jizanga started Langer with twenty rupees. Look where it is today. The return on investment. The return on investment, isn't it? You know what I mean? <laughs> look at the, the whole of Southwell is packed full of Langer. Even though we're now in the cost of living crisis, you could say in the UK. The lunger never stops, you know, the sick font always keep giving and giving and giving and uh, it's just it's such an amazing, amazing concept that Guru Maharaj instilled within the sick font and the sick faith. We're here with Bai Harjit Singh, who's also on the committee, fellow committee member. <laughs> and uh, you know, have you got a message for like the youth that are watching this, Virtual Sick Key viewers? Um, the message I have is, it's lovely that everybody's making uh, an effort to come out to the Nagarikitans today. But education is key to understand why we're here for the Nagar Gitans, why the Guru Prabhs, uh, why, why, why we celebrate Guru Prabhs, what they are. And we're very fortunate that we have amazing channels like Basis Sikhi, Seek to Inspire, uh, that give us that opportunity online to, to learn and um, enhance our intelligence in Sikhi uh, and help us on our journey. So take advantage of those and get involved in Seva, best way to learn. Get involved with basics uh, in, in the seva that you do, the street pachad. Uh, not only are you teaching others, but you're learning yourself. So that would be my message. You tie that the mother yourself? Uh, no. Who ties it? Dad. It's really nice, amazing. Do you feel, what do you feel when you're wearing this, the I feel quite proud because I have to wear this. I normally know, I know wear vodka, but, uh, but I wear the mother sometimes. So, yeah. We're trying to say you're on the hunt for food, yeah? I'm really on, I'm so starving, man. Too much walking takes it's it out. Because you're vegan, so what can you actually eat? Oh, we've got, um... Hi, uh, how are you doing, all right? Very well. Uh, he's from the South Hall Church. We can't talk to him. Anyway, oh, yeah, so, okay, so, uh, good turn, you're on the hunt for food. Yeah, I am, I'm starving. It's because good turn, since vegan. Oh, there's Gurinda Chada. We can talk to her as well. <laughs> we asked we talked to her. So here we are here today with uh, Gurinder Benji, who is a film director. A very famous film, Bendit La Beckham, which was actually filmed in our school, Gurnanik School. Was it? Yeah, was it? In the football, no. football bit at the back. Was no, it not? No, no. Was that a rumor? No. Yeah, rumor. Oh, no, right. no, you just broke oh, my you know what? You're right. It was, was right. filmed at Yedding Football yeah, Club. Football Club. Which That's is it. nearby. Nearby, nearby. So you're at Nugget Keith today. Any message for the Sangat? Oh, yeah. Like, what a beautiful display of Siva and faith and spirituality. I brought my friends, my daughter's friend, loads of people. I wish more people in London could experience what an amazing festival this is and how important the basic tenets of Sikhism is, which is Siva, Sarbatapala, you know, and it's that sharing today and everyone walk around smiling that I, I just find so moving. Thank you so much, Grinda Bunji, for showing your views thank and hopefully you. have a great Nugget Gift then. Ah, oh, I'm sure I will. Thank, thank you. you so I much. come every year, so. Oh, thank you, thank you. Now, I think we're quite thirsty, isn't it? Yeah, let's find a drink. Someone told me that there's actually a Gunna stand here ah. where they're serving uh, cane sugar juice. So let's go, let's go and try and find that. Let's go. Let's go. Well, what's your experience so far of, of this place? Very. I mean, yeah, everyone seems to be having a lot of fun. So, big celebration. The colours are wonderful. Yeah. And the atmosphere is great. Have yeah. you tried any of the food yet? Yes, we yes, have. So, oh very, yes, very all the way. <laughs> what, what, what have you had so far? So we had like onion bhajis, oh. uh, uh, some curry, the chai yeah. tea. Oh, no, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it's well. beautiful, beautiful. Well done. What about yourself, sir? What's your experience been so far? I don't know what uh, what that big piece of fry bread. It looked like beef oh, yeah, chicken. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. I had that last year. It was really nice, right? It's here. That's here. That's my favorite thing so far. Oh, brilliant. Okay, well, thanks a lot for talking, Thank and I hope you, you enjoy the rest of your day. Have a lovely day. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Why are you good? Why are you What would you like to say to Sangat? But just come in it. <laughs> say something. Do it. Come to the Nagar Kirtan. What's your seva here today at Nagar Kirtan? Well, we're the Nagara and the Ransinga. Um, just, you know, helping out Sangat, helping out the Sevadars, wherever they need, uh, with the Palki as well. 
And yeah, that's it. And uh, Gurveer Singh and a few other uh, Nahang Singhs, they do this thing called uh, Guru Card Decorators, right? Thank you, thank you. And uh, they do amazing, amazing seva of, uh, especially during uh, Purabs and uh, different festivals, decorating Maharaji's Palki, backdrops, etc. Um, what is, what's your page called? It's called Guru Card underscore Decorators. You'll see it here on the screen and make sure you give them a follow. So we're just here with Harpreet Kaur, fellow committee member at Sri Singh Sabha. Uh, so Benji, what's your experience today, like uh, bringing the kids and stuff um, at Vasaki? It reminds me of when my mum and dad used to bring me and it's really important for us um, that we ensure that Beedham Singh sees as much as possible that we saw when we were younger. Obviously, the culture of Nagarithan has changed over the last 20, 30 years. But still, to have Sangat all together and to have Guruji's, Guruji's um, darshan when we're out, it's, it's a different feeling and it happens twice a year, masi masi. So it's important that we ensure that all the youngsters come. And uh, you also run a page, right, your lava? Correct. We also run your lava, which is a matrimonial service for SEC. Um, it's really important to reiterate, it's only for people that are ready to get married. So we really encourage anyone to take the time to develop yourself first. Personally, spiritually, professionally, explore yourself and, you know, everything that you want to achieve in life and then take the step to meet somebody. Is there any message you'd give out to like use the people watching this? Um, just in general, like security. try try to get involved in Rogitan from a different perspective, from a different angle. Um, not necessarily stalls. We have a lot of stalls, but there's various servers that you can get involved in. Um, there's usually one or two meetings before the Nagarithan where you can get involved and kind of assess how you can use your skill set. Even if it's in marketing, administration, logistics, just you never know what you can actually contribute with. Oh, so we've just seen. Um rose drink and uh, normally it's very tasty isn't it yeah it's like a shabil right shabil yeah and then what is it made of it's made of milk water and uh, something called ruafza is it that rose syrup rose syrup yeah so let's try it all right let's drink it now not vegan bro so, oh it's so refreshing isn't it it reminds me of when we went to um so here's all side and we met Babaji upstairs and when, when you leave after meeting Babaji they give you the officer, don't they? Yeah. The drink to drink. Especially during the time we went, it was so hot. We're here with Seva Singh. How are you doing Seva? I just walked here from home. Oh you you're going with me today? Yeah. Oh, okay, how's everything there anyway? Good. Are you off to the basics of Sikhi store? <laughs> yeah. Oh that's really good. Are you here on your own, Seva? Yeah. Oh my god, that's it. You have to stick with us now. <laughs> So here we have Sangita who are giving out, I think it's Badam milk. Uh, so let's have a try of some. So we've got some Badam milk here, let's give it a bit of a taste. That is so good. Bro, you want some? Save us thing. Why is it hard to Try it, try it. What do you think of it? It's very nice. What is it? It's a lychee. 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 Oh, good turn thing. You're having it. So this is Gautam Singh's first drink of the day, is it? First drink of the drink again then. So let, tell, us, tell us what you think. So it's Badam milk, it's got Badam in there. You can actually get a gift and it also has saffron. Give it a little taste. It's actually amazing. It's actually... So it's April right now. It should be quite warm, however it's freezing, I think like 5 degrees today and this is really warming me up, hopefully you can hear me in the mic, I can't even hear myself but really really nice, really nice. I think I got a bit lost, a bit lost in translation that it's not a vegan almond milk, it's actually normal milk with almonds in there, good term thing. That's actually milk, normal milk what? with almonds, I think we said it's almond badam milk but Badam Punjabi milk is actually milk, normal milk, with almonds. I'm really sorry to make it to so you. So you missold me? No, no, no. I didn't realise that you were drinking it for that reason, that you didn't know it was normal milk. But we're really sorry about that. Where's the complaint form to fill out, please? <laughs> Can you point me towards a complaint form? <laughs> Did you mess me up? But you know, it doesn't matter because in Maharaj, Amrit is also known as Amrit, isn't it? So we'll insert the Pankti above here. 
that tells about how Amrit is uh, milk is so important uh, towards. And can you put the punk about lying as well? Just... <laughs> Are you not going to drink it now? I know you dance with it. You dance with it anyway. out sings camp leaflets so this one's uh, in august and then there's cause camp as well that's a week before tell us a bit more about things camp because you went last year didn't you yeah yeah I and went... it was kind of like life changing for you wasn't yeah, it yeah, yeah. tell uh, us a bit more about it so uh, when i went to sings camp i was uh, keeping my gears um i was trying at the start but i hadn't taken up with yet and then after sings camp i was just convinced i needed to take up with something just kept telling me it's time now so no yeah, so and with, within a week, right? Within yeah, I think it was a week, week and a half. I think I missed. Uh, I think I did. I miss it. I no, no, you didn't. You went the first one. The first one. So the first Amr St. John after Singh's camp. Welcome Singh was there in the Amr St. John and yeah. bless his Amrit. So what would you would you recommend Singh's camp to people? Hundred percent, hundred percent. Whether you're Munna, whether you're Singh uh, that hasn't taken Amrit, even if you have taken Amrit, it'll be wicked because it'll just make you stronger in your faith. And maybe you can just show the uh, poster and the QR codes in there as well. Application open today, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So apply now. That's Sings Camp and then you've got Cause Camp as well. Yeah. Can't believe that. Why good you go Khalsa? Why good you go there? That's a big fatty. Why good you go Khalsa? Why good you go Khalsa? Yeah. How are you finding the Nagar Gir then? Good. How do you, do you like it? Yeah. Are you enjoying it? Have you had any food yet? No. no. What do you want to see the Nagar Gir then? What do you want to see? Very religious guy, you? You're so religious. Are you a Khalsa? Are these all Khalsa as well? You see lots of Khalsa here today. Yeah? Do you like it? Go and do a big Jakarta for the for the microphone. Go and do a big Oh no, oh, then that's enough. Why you Feed on me. Yeah, ready? Yeah. Take a day again. Hello. What's the plan now? Plan, uh, maybe speak to a bit more Sangat, see if there's more food, because I've, I've hardly any food to be honest. Just on Gar Singh, he's eating most of the time, I'm just watching him, so hopefully I can get some uh, some food and yeah, speak to some more Sangat. So we have just found the Gunnar Sol, you can see it over there. So yeah, I'm really, really excited to go and taste some <laughs> sugar cane juice. And Gustavian can drink it as well because it's vegan. It's actually vegan this time, yeah? Sorry, <laughs> sorry, sorry. So yeah, loads and loads of Sangat here today. Seva, have you ever had Gunnar juice before? Yeah. You have had it, where have you had it? India. Where in India? Uh, what does it taste like? Sweet from what I can remember. Yeah, it's very, very sweet. Come, come and join us as we have some. Sweet like on Gar Singh. <laughs> <laughs> so here we have the Gunnar store here at the Nagargit then, right? And what, what Gunnar Ras is, it's a drink made of sugar cane. And you can see the line is actually on the other side, so Let's go and line up on the other side. Should we line up and have it? After all that hype. Yeah, it's too, too much queue there and too much rush and too much push. 
So we're in front of the Casa A10 here, which is an organization that provides humanitarian relief across the world to victims of not only natural disasters, so you have floods, earthquakes, famine, but also man-made disasters as well, such as war. And interestingly, Casa Aid has its name inspired by Sikki. So their slogan is recognize the whole human race as one. So now we're coming up to the base of Sikki stall. And we're going to speak to some of our Sevadars there and see how they've been getting along. So we've actually got special guest's parents. Why do these things back on BOS vlogs? Why are you good to go, Hansa? Why are you good to go? What's up, you right? You're right. You're good, yeah. Reunion right here. What are you saying, man? Yeah, what, how are you feeling? What am I saying? We're back on BOS vlogs, man. Uh, well, yeah. Go on, say something. We're at Nugget Yeah. Uh, what do you mean to say? <laughs> so, what, what, what are you doing here today? I just came, I'm looking for food. Where's the good food? <laughs> Where's the good come, come. So, we're here at the Hang Santia stall which is an organization that teaches Gurbani Santia how to read Gurbani. So all the way from Uda Era, all the way to actually reading Guru Granth Sahib Ji should, so with perfect pronunciation. So we're here one of the Sevadars, Rohan V Singh, you may have noticed in some of the other vlogs, and I'm based in Sikhi. I'm just going to ask him what his experience has been since he started doing Santia. What difference has it made to your Guru Sikhi Jeevan? So I mean, why would you go to Khalsa? I probably can't, I'll do a disservice if I talk about the importance of Santia and how important it is in a Guru Sikhi Jeevan. But just from my own experience, Santia has been really, really beneficial in my Gursikhi and my Jeevan, you know, just having that discipline and spending more time with Maharaj. When you have to do your 25 times of Bias, which means 25 times practice or whatever you've learned in the lesson previous, you're spending more time on things, investing your time in Sikhi rather than, for me, not playing FIFA or like just doing stuff that's not going to enhance my Sikhi Jeevan. So yeah, Santia is very important. And today you guys are selling some brand new calendars, right? So yeah. a lot of research has been done to get the correct dates of Gurpubs and other important dates within the Sikh calendar. So let's just have a look at some of these. So you can see here, so we're here in the month of Jid. And you can see here that they've done a lot of research to say actually what are the important dates. So we've got Guru Amradas Ji's Guru Gaddi on the 2nd, on the 9th of, uh, of, of Jid, which is the 22nd of March. So these are actually available online at nihangsantia.com. So it's a really great resource, something you can just have on your desk that would be amazing. It's a constant reminder to us. So we've just come inside a shop where it's nice and quiet so we can share Saki about the importance of Gurbani Santia, where we can learn to read Gurmukhi, that language, the alphabet that's come from the Guru's Muk, the Guru's mouth. And so one time in the time of Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji, the Sangha had gathered and Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji said that is there anybody here who can read Japji Sahib Shud, meaning with perfect pronunciation, purely. And after asking three times, there's a Guru Sikh that came forward called Bhai Gopala Ji. Bhai Gopala Ji said that Guruji, if you bless me, then I may be able to read Japji Sahib Shud. Because without your blessings, I can't do anything. And so Bhai Gopala Ji, before they started reading Japji Sahib, Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji got down off their throne and put Bhai Gopala Ji on a higher level. So just showing the respect that Guruji had for Gurbani. And Bhai Gopala Ji started reading Japji Sahib. And they were reading it with such love, such concentration, and pronouncing the Gurbani so perfectly that Guru Hargobind Sahib Ji got so happy. And they thought, what can I give by Gopala Ji? Do I give them a saropar? And they thought, no, nah, that's not enough. Do I give them rule over a village? That's not enough as well. So do I give them rule over five villages? And Guruji said, that's not enough. Then they said, why don't I give them rule over the whole earth, the whole world? And Guruji thought that that rule is going to come to an end. What if I give them rule over other worlds? And then afterwards, Guruji thought that the only thing left is to give them the guruship, to become the next guru. And so when Guruji got up, Bhai Gopala Ji saw in the corner of the eye that Guruji has started moving. And they thought that Guruji must be really happy with me and that Guruji is going to ask me, what do I want? And Bhai Gopala Ji thought that those five horses that Bhai Gopala Ji thought that I wanted one of those horses that Bhai Bidhi Chand had given to Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji. Those horses that were worth 125,000 rupees each. Three of them had been given to some Guru Sikhs, one of them were for Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji, and the other one is the one that I would like. So Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji came and embraced Bhai Gopala Ji and said, tell me, what do you want? And Bhai Gopala Ji said that I want one of those horses that you were gifted. And Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji said, you want one of those horses? I was going to give you the guruship. So Guru Hargobin Sahib Ji blessed Bhai Gopala Ji with one of those horses, as well as many other gifts, a really expensive saddle. They gave them a saropa, they gave them gold, and they said that your family and your future generations will be liberated. 
And so this Saki shows us how important Gurbani Santya is. That Guru Hargobind Sahib Ji was ready to give the Guruship to somebody who could read Japji Sahib Shud. And so maybe we can take a step towards Guru Sahib and start to learn Gurbani Santya. And there's so many different resources you can use to learn Gurbani Santya. I will include some of them in the description below. Now, let's get back to the Nagar Kirtan. We're here at the basic store, and here you can see behind, we've got Baban Singh, our events coordinator. Some say he lifted up a car with his bare hands. So let's go and speak to him. Why Guru Ji Ka Ka Saab, Why Ji Fateh? How are you you okay? I'm okay, thank you. How are you Guru Charan Singh? I'm doing good. Now that I've seen you, have your darshan, I'm, I'm, I'm excellent. <laughs> what, what, how's the day been so far? It's been very nice, Guru Kirpa. Very well organised by the Gurdwara Saab. They kind of gone all out. It seems like uh, every year it seems to get better. The weather's nice, it's dry, so there's so much Sangat coming today, so... Have you had a chance to go around to some of the other stores, maybe get a bite to eat, something to drink? We had a couple of uh, uh, cheeky bites of pakori, so we kind of worked out. That's, that was one of the first things we did when we came, <laughs> just to work out, you know, what's hot and what's not. What have you had to drink? Water, of course, a couple of cups of tea, which is always good as well. I can, I can, see, I can see you've had something to drink. <laughs> Thank you so much. Like you so much. What you got there, bro? So there seems to be some secret supply of ice creams here. Where did you get that from, G? Where were they from? I don't know. Somebody handed it to me. He's double parked. He's got a down one. Yeah, look here. Something. Is that? There's a mic. <laughs> well, yeah. Happy Pesaki. <laughs> you come all the way from Birmingham, did you? Uh, yeah, I have. You came back last night to, to, to set all this up and start this seva, yeah? Okay? yeah. So, what's your experience of South Hall Nagarkeetan compared to the ones in Birmingham? Um, it's probably... Um, better, right? I wouldn't say better, necessarily. Um, there's more people, more, um, you know, people out there, more Sangat in that sense. Um, but yeah, it's very lively in the streets. So, overall, Mandeep saying South Hall is about 10 times better than Birmingham so we're all we're all one community though it's all it's all part of the same love yeah thank you so thank you so much <laughs> it's a light you drink and it's got this jelly in there so I'll do a live taste test yeah live taste test you heard it first here mm. I need a score out of 10 please consistency I'd say 10 out of 10 sweetness very sweet it just tastes like a bubble tea um with the do you know when you have the bu uh, bubbles or the fruit jelly in there that's what it tastes like. No. What and what, and what about the colour? What, what, what do you think of the colour of it? The colour is, it looks like it's got bare chemicals in there, but it tastes really, really nice. Daman Singh, have you got, what, you know more about the drink, innit? We've got the, we've got our supplier here. First hand interview. <laughs> I'm not the supplier. So can you tell us a bit more about this drink, please, G? Well, these are from Thailand, yeah? It's just jelly and flavoured drink in it, lychee, the bare bang. <laughs> How did you find out about this? Bro, it's all over the place. It's in every half license. And they're vegan as well, so. And uh, what do you rate the, the taste out of 10? 10. There you go, you heard it, you gotta have a try. And just one more question for the supplier. I would say, is Pikachu your favourite Pokemon or is it one of your. <laughs> it's just yellow, bro, it's actually basic. <laughs> we'll take that as a yes. We'll take that as a yes. Pikachu jump, bro. Yes. You have to lift the dolly to show it. I was hoping the dolly comes in it. Oh, no, it was just a, a show of appreciation, I think. And so, um, the family follower of the, the podcasts on Spotify and YouTube and I thought the re recent episodes are very good uh, especially the one about Amrit Paul Singh recently that's suppose the research and the fact that you had someone on there that was he'd actually stayed with is on the street yeah he knew what the school wasn't you know <laughs> third hand information it was really well done and well produced so just credit to you guys for like spreading the positive word about yourself yeah, so yeah that was always the plan to do, mm. like, give, do the prachar in like informal oh yeah way, and like a laid back like, oh exactly and I think for someone who's um, well, second generation the fact that you know it's a situation where it's easy to understand. My oldest son is now a teenager, so he watches them sometimes with me as well. And I think it's a good thing to kind of spread the word in a really good way, yeah. easy, accessible, and all that kind of stuff. You know. So yeah. Thank you so, so keep much. up the good work. Thank keep up the good work, buddy. Yeah, right, cool. Bye, get caught up. Thank you. So we're outside here, tent uh, where some Nahang Tings are making a special drink called Shardai. And just as a background for those who don't know what Nahang Tings are, so they're a distinct military order within the Sikh faith. And they're recognizable here by their blue bana, so their blue dress, and also by multiple shastas. So you can see here, some of these things here, they've got multiple shastas. So you've got your main kirpan here. What other shastas are you, are you wearing, Ji? The one near the Sanova Sav. Manji. And what other shastas? You wear some in your damala as well, in your, in your dastar? Yeah, the double chandra, chandra. Manji. And uh, 
चांद हाँ जी सही साग so you see, they, they, so they've got multiple chasas they wear, and this drink that they're making is called Shardai. And what's amazing about this drink is it's a high protein nutrient drink that not only gives them the nutrients, but at different times of the year, they use different ingredients. So in the winter, they use more warmer ingredients like saffron, and this then prevents them from feeling the chill of the winter. And in the summer, they use cooler ingredients so they don't feel the burning of the heat. So we'll go now to this to the stall and see how they're preparing this shardai and what is in the ingredients. Why Guruji ka khalsa? Why Guruji fate? Singo today we've been preparing uh, shardaiya for the sangat. Niang Singh Ali she did dega hunda but for the sangat we prepare shardaiya. This was given to us by Shame Pasha ji. Theek hai ji before madan jang de vich she da singo nu bhog lagda and then uh, for the sangat this shardaiya. So if you like to follow me, I could take you to where the nishan nagari are where we prepare it. Theek hai ji. Aajo. So we start from this end. You could see Samurai Singh. Can you show the slaughter, please? So this is what we use. We use the slaughter to crush down all the ingredients. We have badam, kali mirch, lechia, um, and, and, and sugar. Tika. And then for Nyang Singh, is it she did the gans or tika? And then we mix it in that. As uh, as you can see, one of the Singhs doing over there. And yet. Tika. So he's got all the ingredients in there. And yet. So how long is it it takes to to for kind of one preparation of a drink? Ideally you want to take around 45 minutes. Okay, to do it properly. And then you end up with a paste. That's like that tea guy. Then once that paste is made, you can see what the singer is doing here. He's got it in like a uh it's like it's like a cheesecloth. Yeah, it's a thin cloth where you filtrate it through through water and then that's when you end up with the shardanya. Tea guy and that's what we're serving for the sangate. So it takes about 45 minutes. Yeah, and you and you can see sing that jor lag da. And and are there different um cuz I've heard different times of the year you use different ingredients like in the winter sometimes. You, you can look for for shardanya you can you can add different things. You can add magish some people use rose petals you can uh some people use gesser you you can change the ingredients but the main ingredients are badam lechi ya kali mirch okay and and sugar these are the things that you can use those are the main ingredients but as your with your personal preference whatever you may feel that you your your sleep needs you you can adjust it uh accordingly and it was in so in the times the bus was in uh, the hungsi was to prepare this to kind of be like a fuel for the so the so in dalpan we prepare we prepared the shiti dega twice a day amritullah and then sham devalla so just before eras okay but then in jang of the summer the years before madani jang that singers would prepare this to prepare themselves Amazing. okay so it's a it's a very nutrient rich as you can see right all the badams going in all the lechi are going in yeah so it tastes amazing as well had some as well so yeah, good good price right now that's a good job to that's a compliment things why could you go hall so why you don't hide what you are yeah kirpa ji how's your nugget kirtan video from bengal yeah from bengal ji yeah why group how's it compared to bengal bengal nugget kirtan a lot more busier yeah a lot more busier a lot more sung yeah but otherwise same enjoying it yeah enjoying it having a nice time big up london yeah why could you go hall so why could you give it there So we're here today with representatives of Midlands uh, Langer Seva Society, correct? Yeah. Would you like to tell us a bit more about your charity and what things you do? So we do um seva in different parts of the country, local sort of um uh, towns, um we serve food langer to the homeless, anyone, you know, certain times at the moment with um cost of living people are coming to us we're serving them food um we in south or have um a station in greenford um and we have local restaurants who serve us vegetarian food every friday 6:30 to 7:30 um you know everyone's m- most welcome to come along how are you finding the nugget gear then so far oh it's beautiful it's the sangat hai the energy is really great lots of seva dars around um and it's it's good it's good to come along it's good to come along yeah. thank you so much thank you so is this the first time you've come to a, a nugget kitchen that we're celebrating today no we've done this one a few times before and what's your experience of kind of these kinds of celebrations that we do over here it should be embraced we enjoy doing them actually makes t- takes away from our main street stuff it's good it's always enjoyable oh it's amazing you always get the food <laughs> and how about your experience what what have you found so far uh, excellent food um and the uh, the procession's very entertaining very colorful and uh, it's a good day oh, it's amazing quite a nice, lovely atmosphere kind of kind of yeah, community atmosphere right yeah it's all inclusive yeah. it's good
So, what, so what's been your favourite food? You said you've enjoyed the food. Fruit. What's the favourite one you've had? Might have just been an onion bar, oh, nice. with mint sauce. Very good, very good. Oh, brilliant. Well, thanks so much for it. Thank thanks you so much. Thank you. Take care. Thank you too. Thank you. How are you feeling so far? Hungry, man. Hungry. Okay. All the talk of food. I've hardly had anything. Talking of hungry. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh my God. Thanks so much. Got some pasta. Hey, let me get another one. You got a pasta? Go, you got one. So we've actually found some, found some pasta that they're going to give them as well. So we're going to do a taste test now. So you yeah? can see here that Ankar Singh has actually got two plates. So and I've got one. So. That's lovely. That's so yum, yum in it. Lovely. What the what the um. You're a man of... It's like proper Madombi flavours in here as well. What's this stuff on top it's of it? It's like the with pasta in there, isn't it? That's it's very lovely. spicy as well. That's lovely, yeah. It's got Amazing. a kick to it, yeah. Proper kick, proper kick, yeah. Let's carry on, because I think we're holding up all the sun with But yeah, amazing pasta. We'll get, we'll get a, we'll get a, just got a... Mole, Sonihan! Maybe not. <laughs> it's worth a try. Mole, Sonihan! What's your guy? Are you doing you okay? Yeah, I'm good. What's your experience of the Nagakitan so far? I love it so much. It's so wonderful. I love the culture. Oh, amazing. Yeah. So are you, are you, is this the first time you've come to one? Or no, you come, I came before. You come before. Yeah. What about yourself? I like it as well. You like it as well? Do you know what a Nagakitan is? What we're doing here? It's like a Sikh parade in which uh, the Pakistan and you all do. The Pakistan edition, like, kind of see and uh, Oh, no, it's really good, yeah. So, so we're here basically going from place to place, singing Wahiguru's praises, singing Gurbani, and we're doing it. Do you know why we're doing it today? So what's your favorite? What's, what's your favorite bit so far? Uh, the Pakistan. Yeah, I like doing go to it and darshan on it. I love it so much. Oh, wow. They're decorated so lovely. They actually spend the whole night before decorating the Pakistan. Yeah, Where are you gonna go to now? We're gonna go to my tent. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Yeah, yeah. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? Oh, it's in the corner. Oh, nice. Where's your tent? So do you know why we're here today, celebrating? Yeah. What's it for, G? Uh, uh, Vasaki. And what is, do you know what Vasaki is? Yeah, when Guru uh, Gobind Singh created the castle. And you're amazing, yeah. So we're, do, we're celebrating in the form of Nagar Gitan. So do you, do you know what Nagar Gitan actually means? I'm not sure. So basically, Nagar means like town or village, and Gitan is obviously the singing of Vaheguru praises of Gurbani. So when you say that Nagar Gitan together, it means actually going from town to town singing Gurbani. So spreading that love, that fragrance. And many saints actually in the past would do this. So I don't know if you've heard of Sant Uttar Singh Ji, Sant Kartar Singh Ji, there's also Pai Rindir Singh Ji. They would walk around with just a vajja and they would just sing the praises whilst they're walking the street. And there were so many people who would get inspired by it as well. And so we don't even know actually whoever hears this Kirtan today that it could change their lives as well. So what's your experience so far today of being of the Nagar Kirtan? Uh, it's been good. There's loads of people and it's like a, it's a good atmosphere. Uh, where, where have you been to? Have you been to any stores? Have you, have you gone to the Gurkha or seen? We've been to a few stores. That's it. What's the highlight being in today so far apart from speaking to me? I just got here like an hour ago. But food, food, food. Yeah, I just think the food. Yeah, you, you sound like a bit of a foodie, right? What was your favourite bit? Probably the bread pakori. Where's that? Yeah, back then. It's near Mefu. Oh, I missed that one. What about yourself, G? Probably the Jalebis. Jalebis? Where's that store? You don't have any Jalebis. Oh, uh, near Mefu as well. It's not only the Sikh community who are here today in Safo at the Nagar then. We also have the Sri Ram Hindu Mandir who are here serving Langar at the Nagar then. So let's go and check what they are doing. So we are here at the stall by the Hindu Mandir of Safo. Um, thank you so much for doing your stall here today. Would you like to say a few words about Vasaki? Nagar Kirtan the Guru Singh Sabha the Sari Committee no the unna the jere seva dar unna no sanu lakh lakh badai. How did you get involved in doing this kind of service for them? First, my first time. Oh really? My first time. What's your experience so far of of, of doing this? It's interesting. I like it. Though. I come to this area well, a lot. It's a very great experience. We're all enjoying sunny weather as well. And I can say good luck to all of you. And it's nice that we've all come together as a community. There's no division. We're all here, that one love. So what we should use, get together, work together as well. Thank you. Keep up the good work.
Oh, thank, thank you so much. Keep up the good work. Good to keep the content coming, man, to uh, educate people. Oh, really? Thank you yeah. so much. And that kind of stuff is good because you can pull it onto other people. Well. And yes, that's and the thing, that's isn't the it? That's the main yeah. thing, isn't it? All these uh, false narratives that will be coming out from, uh, from everywhere. So. Exactly. We've got to stand up for what's right, isn't 100%, it? So otherwise, 100%. if we stay silent, yeah. our kids in the future are going to say, oh, what did you do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. At least, no, at least you can say, at least we tried, right? Yeah, good. good, good. Thank you so much. Well done, Thank you so much. Well Hi there, so is this your first time witnessing these celebrations that we're doing? So I'm very lucky, uh, no, so uh, it's not, so we, we try and get involved every year. Uh, uh, so this is, uh, I think this is my fifth time uh, present here, uh, along with the crews and our outreach teams. We've got Dee Dale there, who's, uh, who's uh, involved in the celebration. So our fire engine is within the procession, one of our fire engines is in the procession. So we actively love to get involved and uh, help support the celebrations, whilst also giving our public safety messages. Oh, mate, so you're here to support just in case anything goes wrong, anything goes down? Well, we've got the emergency planning element of that as well, so we've got a fire engine around the side, but we, we actively want to get involved in the community celebrations and also be able to sell our, uh, to push our messages of public safety and home fire safety and outreach, actually, and in terms of recruitment processes as well. Oh, it's amazing. Thank you so much. And what's your experience generally been of kind of these Sikh celebrations that take place every year? It's just fantastic. Uh, the, just the sense of community and sense of strength and all being part of the same family is absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Food drinks just brilliant well and more specifically about the food what's your kind of favorite favorite food that you like to go to every year oh uh, well we're really lucky because we get so many deliveries and we're oh. by so it's just it's just it's just a, a massive mix uh, I, i'll be honest with you i don't know what it's called but something i had earlier on that was just really quite spicy it was absolutely brilliant what, what was it? it was like a kind of a bread or was it something no no it was uh i'll have to ask d d what was uh, what were we what were we eating earlier on the really spicy thing? So we had pakore earlier on. Uh, pakore. We had pakore. We had um, some char, some desi char, um, and we've had jalebi. Yeah, so we've eaten. Yeah, well, we've, we've eaten well. Eaten. We've eaten really well. So, so thank you. Are you uh, the Sikh channel? You're Sikh channel. So we're, we're basically Sikh, uh, faces of Sikhi. So uh, yeah. and we've got another sister channel, so uh, Boss TV. Mm -hmm. So we're here basically. It's a channel to spread the message of of Sikhi in English. So it's maybe we live in England now, and a lot of people maybe don't speak Punjabi, or it's difficult to maybe to learn the teachings. And so we're here actually just to try and spread that message in English. Uh, I'm really just trying to spread the message of love, really, of, of God. Um, and yeah, I mean you can see here there's so many Sikh Sikh community here in Southall, and so we're kind of using it as an opportunity to speak to people, raise awareness of actually what we're celebrating today because many people like, like myself a few years ago I didn't really know what a Nagar Kirtan is uh, and what we're celebrating what Vasaki is so these are things we're actually um, celebrating so how long have you guys been in the service here? So we've both done yeah. Well, years? Yeah, 90, 20 years yeah and, but specifically myself in Southall for the last few years so we're, we're always actively involved in it where we can uh, in, the, in the procession elements as much as we can and as I say the, the so I'm, a Sikh. I'm a Sikh I'm a Sikh firefighter my mum's a baptised Sikh she's I'm a, a thuddy so obviously I know about Sikhism and we for since I've joined we've always joined in with Kita. and we need to spread the message to our community this is our community this is our fire station and for us it's to share what we know with the hundreds of thousands of people, whoever, how many ever are walking through, you know, we'll, we'll be there, we've got the fire engine in the procession, um, and usually as many Sikh firefighters as we can will come and help support London Fire Brigade and the local station in the event, you know, every single year. Well, it's amazing to hear, and thank you so much for your service, and I hope you have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Take care. Take care. Don't be shy, don't be shy. Are you guys, are you guys having fun today? Yeah? What's your favourite bit? What was your favourite bit? Did you have some nice food? Did you have something nice to drink? What did you, what did you eat? What did, see, um, we didn't eat anything, but what did you listen to? Keith. You listened to Keith? You listened to Keith then? Yeah. Oh, nice. So is this your first time? Have you been here before? Is it your first time? Yeah. First time? We've been before. What about you guys? Is this your first time or have you been here before? We've been here for four. Oh, nice. So what's your experience of it been today? Has it been fun? Yeah. Like, we listen to Keaton and we, like, go, went and, like, uh, buy some stuff, like, other, like others. And do, do you know what uh, what's actually celebrating today? What What's taking place? Um, I'm not sure. Wait, yeah, I'm not sure. That's okay. That's fine. That's what we're here for. So, so basically, was a nugget Keaton's happening today, yeah? Today. What are we celebrating today? I think we're celebrating, um... I think we're just celebrating. Begins with a V? Visaki. Yeah, Visaki. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the, celebrating Visaki. Do you know what Visaki is? Yeah, yeah. Like, it's like um, the time when um, 
Guru Gobind Singh Ji came into the town, into our town, and then everyone like like, like lighted up the town with lights and stuff. So, so Guru, you're right, so Guru Gobind Singh Ji came to the city of Anandpur Sahib, and they actually created the Khalsa. And that's what we're doing this Nugget Keetan here today, to celebrate that. So what's your favourite bit of today been so far? I think uh, it's been listening to all the Keetan. Oh, that's amazing. Are there any specific Shabads that you like, or any, any your favourite ones that you connect to? Um, I think I like all of them. Oh, cool. That's amazing. What about your, what's your favourite part? I like all of them. Um, oh, the, um, I like the Keetan mostly, and the food. Oh, which, which food is it they like? Uh, chole Pudude. Oh, Chole Pudude. I've not had those yet, but they must be really nice. So, well, thank you so much, and I hope you have a lovely day. Yeah? Thank you. So, what's your favourite part been today? What, what's my favourite part? Yeah. My favourite part is, like, when, uh, when you, like, go to the, uh, get close to, you know, the thing. You to, good, to Guru Granth Sahib Ji? Yeah. Well, it's really busy, isn't it? Everyone's trying to do mud aren't they? Did, yeah. you, did you get a chance to do mud yet? No. I think the barkey's coming, so you still got a chance. I want a question. Why are you PlayStation support instead of Xbox? Um, PlayStation because it's just uh, better. <laughs> Why are we here today? What are we celebrating? Are we celebrating Vasaki, I think. And yeah, and well, what is Vasaki? Vasaki is a celebration. Well, I know that Vasaki is mostly for farmers, harvest. So it originally started out as a celebration of harvest. So there's the month of Vesak, which is the second month in the Sikh calendar, which is where actually the harvest took place. And then Guru Gobi Singh in 1699, they gave us a greater meaning where the, the Khalsa was created. So that's why we're celebrating Vasaki here today, just to remember that Guru Gobi Singh in 1699 created the Khalsa. So what was your favorite bit today? My favorite, about, about the Nugget Keaton? Okay, the Nug about the Nugget Keaton was obviously the food. I really loved the food. What was, the, what was your favorite one? Chola Batuli. Chola Batuli, that seems to be everyone's favorite. Yeah. Well, thank you so much and have a good day, yeah? yeah thank you. Bye, Gaji Kalka, bye, Gaji Fateh. Bole Sone Ale! What's so nice here yeah, is that random Sangha <laughs> just were like, give me the mic, I want to speak. And then you can see how much like Piyad and like, passion they have, right? They just started doing Jakari. So it's good though, it's amazing. Isn't it, Ankar? Yeah, yeah. A lot, of, a lot of vibration, good energy here, isn't it? Uh, we're going to try and cut through the park and hopefully we can uh, get some interviews in there from the middle. We're from Base of Siki, we're like, you want to talk on uh, camera? Parayog, no English, no English. Uh, Like in um, India, a lot of these uh, events, they're like a, a milla, right? A milla is like what? Uh, a gathering. A gathering, like a festival type thing. Yeah. So the same way here, in South Hill Park, is, it's a bit of a festival. So they've got the whole fun fair set up. And uh, you can see how many people are here. It's, it's packed, there's so many people. Yeah. Do you want to go on a few rides, going to read? No, no, not today. Come on, let's do it. I, I'm going to get unwell, bro. So, Paji, we're here at the Nugget Kitan and we're just asking everyone what is Vasaki? Vasaki, I think, uh, what the Nugget Kitan or Vasaki? Hanji, yeah, Vasaki in general. Vasaki in general, I think it's about, yeah, it's birth of the Khalsa. Hanji, yeah. Panji Piare, Guru Gobind Singh, basically, a lot of Sikhs know the story. Hanji. Very good story, I think. Mm. Yeah, it's just when uh, Guru Gobind Singh Ji selected five Panja Piyare, and then uh, he did the uh, start the Khalsa, Khalsa Pant. Uh, exactly, yeah. yeah so, birth of the Khalsa. So, yeah, so uh, basically, Sikhi, that's what we're doing. We're just trying to create awareness and yeah. like teach everyone about what is Vasaki. So in 1699 at Sri Anandpur Sahib, yeah. that's where Guru Sahib gathered all of the Sikhs, and they asked for five heads. And then you know the story, right? Yeah. Uh, the Panj Piyare came forward and they gave their heads. And yeah. the, the, an interesting fact is, did you know Guru Sahib also took Amrit as well? Yeah, oh, yeah. From the, the Panj Piyare. Yeah. 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 So that just shows how amazing our, yeah. our Guru Sahib is yeah. and how yeah. humble they were, right? Yeah. And also it shows the importance of taking Amrit. Yeah. So is any of you Amritari? Yeah. 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 Beautiful. That's sick. Yeah. Soon, soon, soon. Uh, soon, okay. Andy. Yeah, we got you on camera, yeah? <laughs> yeah. He right. said it. Thanks a lot, bro. Okay, why you So, just go on that one, I'll get a, I'll get a video of you. So, on card, you want to go on it, yeah? Yeah, go on then, jump on. So, you can see here there's thousands and thousands of people here. So, just imagine in 1699, Guru Gobind Singh Ji, they got 80,000 people to come to City and Anpur Sahib. And then, out of those 80,000, when Guru Gobind Singh Ji asked, I need a head. Five of them came forward and they became the Panch Biyari. 
Ferrari's uh, ride at the fun fair. And it's quite expensive, isn't it? Well, uh, it was for me, yeah, but you got it free. <laughs> yeah, so join us at the top. Um, oh, can I be in the Yeah, yeah sure. So do you know actually what we're... Like getting so, filmed. So, yes, yeah, filming. Oh, yeah, 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 he's filming me. He's filming me. Where is this going? It's going on TikTok or something. YouTube, TikTok, yeah! Instagram. Go, go, go. We're, so, we're, the, we're the biggest Sikh media channel outside of India. We get millions of views as well. Yeah. So, so, wow. do, do, well. Congratulations! <laughs> Congratulations, thank you very much. We are just going on the ride now. Um, hopefully we can do some nice retard at the top, right? Well, we've just eaten a lot as well, so hopefully... You've eaten a lot. We've just eaten a lot. <laughs> hopefully you don't feel sick or anything like that, innit? That's not a good sign. Today's Nugget Eve then has just been quite quite nice because it's a proper, first proper Nugget Eve then since Covid. And uh, so much hunger, so much positive energy. Yeah, it's really nice, really it's nice. It's been amazing, it's been amazing, yeah. Okay, so our friends are ready to ask to answer some questions again. So, do you know why we're here today? Um, no. Because I want to go on a few rides. I want to go on a ride. So this is all actually part of a celebration, a Sikh celebration of Vesaki, which is where we're, when the Sikhs were initiated back in 1699, our 10th Guru actually formed what's called the Khalsa. So it's like the form of a Sikh you see today, like here. So we've got a turban, we've got a good palm, just like a sword, we've got a steel bangle, we also have the like undergarments and also a comb in the head as well. And the cro <laughs> the crocs are his own special, special thing that he's got going on. I feel like, especially what we're going around doing today, even though we are having a great time and enjoying the festivities, Telling people about actually the essence of Vasaki, what Vasaki is really about, and what it really is about is giving yourself to Guru Sahib. The Panj Singh who stood up that day, they are the Fiyade of Guru Sahib, and we also want to be the Fiyade of Guru Sahib, the beloved of Guru Sahib. And what does Maharaj want? Our head. And you know, it's as simple as that. Are we willing to give everything to Maharaj? And what, what happens when you do that? All you get is Maharaj's Kushia, right? Maharaj's love. And I think that's the what. Oh, I agree. Are we filming now, yeah? That's what Vala G wants, right? Is a Kushia. So let's all get Vala G's Kushia. Let's all, if you can, have Umbreth, right? This is the whole point of life. One day we're doing all this with Jahad so that people will have Umbreth one day, isn't it? What do you think? That's what we're doing. I didn't say Joe to play with Kenan Akar Jahad. Say it after all the time. I can't say he's getting a bit frightened now, he's starting oh. talking, he's getting a bit frightened now. This is a bit, it's quite fast, isn't it? Oh my god. So, oh, I can't get it. Hold, hold it tight, yeah. So, I yeah. so, I mean, we're going around in circles now. Oh. And even for many people, they go around their whole life going around in circles, finding, oh searching for that truth, yeah. right? And we're so fortunate that actually we found that truth. We have the Gorbis. We're talking about some serious. <laughs> we're just serious with Jai, man. Yo, where are you busy then? Yeah? I'm not giving a hand. You're saying, oh, we're too busy. So, people go around searching that truth. Yeah. And so, we also go around the circle of life and death as well, right? We keep coming back into these different life forms. And actually, when we take Amrit, then actually, we actually end those life forms, right? We become unlit, it becomes like beyond death, man. Right? We become immortal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, that's yeah, a bit of V-chard. <laughs> and, and it's with Umrah that the cycles of birth and death get cut, isn't it? So, oh. that's our little V-chard. Are you okay, Uncle Zinni? You get too shook up, did you? I think I'm a bit, a bit worried there for a second. He's up there saying, we're going to do loads of each other. <laughs> He's like going, oh, hi, hi. Alright, that's a bit quite much. We're going to upside down one now. Upside down. Upside down, Mitchell. What do you think? Shut up, that's a few. <laughs> Go read over there. <laughs> Today we are here with Dida the God from Princess to Warrior. Dida, please tell us a bit more about Princess to Warrior, the work that you do and what you are doing here today at the Nugget Gita then. Very good, Jika Kasa. Very good, Jika Fateh. Um, so Princess to Warrior is a female-run organisation that helps to support and build our cause. So if you do want to come on this journey of Sikhi and you're starting off or you're kind of, you're art on Ritali and you want to develop your Sikhi journey, please come. We do monthly forums at Havelock Road. And it's so important for us, Bibia, to stick together because we are the backbone of Sikhi and we really need to ensure that we keep this strength and unity within us. Um, and the more we can encourage each other and push each other, the stronger we can get as a calm. 
Um, and today we're here at the South Onoga Geethan and we're really lucky to be able to have the opportunity to actually do Seva here as well um, and see so many families coming together um, and everyone celebrating Vasaki together. It's a really kind of inspirational and really mem um, really memorable thing to see that every year when we come and we're able to do this Seva, it's something that a lot of people can't get to do. So if you can come down and you can do this Seva, please get involved um, and let's do it together. Yeah, thank you so much, Dira. Make sure you give Princess Tawaria a follow on Instagram. So we're just on a full round of the whole Nugget Gear then. Uh, we're back now to where we started, didn't it, really? Yeah. In the morning. We're back at Gunry's Masi's house. And uh, hopefully we can have some nice chips now, isn't it? Yeah, let's have um, a, Even though we've eaten so much, it was just snacky food, didn't it? Yeah. So hopefully now we can have something nice to eat. And now I can see some beautiful good sticks there at the back. So let's go say hello to everyone. And then we can have a break. Yeah. <laughs> So we're here at Garvi Nanniji's house where they serve a beer. We have Nanniji here. This is Nanniji who has been doing seva for a whole life at every single South of Nugget Girdan. And um, it's just an amazing, amazing thing to see such good mugs like this who dedicate their whole life to seva. Nanniji has also done some, a lot of sangha of Sant Baba Thakur Singhji. And uh, it just shows in her bhavna for Sikhi and seva. We've got, we've got good sticks over here on the left making chips as well. Um, Nanaji here, always involved in Seva. We have Bhai Arjun Singh Ji here. Why good you got Hey Arjun, you right? How are you doing? How's everything? How's everything going so far? It's been amazing. So busy today as well. Yeah. Yeah, busier than usual, yeah. I'm lucky the sun's out as well. It's been really good. How are you doing? We just went to the fun fair on the rides. Oh, can we have some chips as well, yeah? Yeah, of course. Have it. And we got Meher Singh here as well. Why good you got How are you doing, Meher Singh? You alright? Yeah, man. How are you guys? How's Nugget Keep then been so far? Very easy going, to be fair. We've got a good system going on. Man, so Happy Vasaki, then Man, so far. Meher looks a bit tired, man. <laughs> Very hot here. Yeah, yeah, it's hot, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, I can't wait to have some chips, man. Can't wait, can't wait. I see what the dark pani banaya, mutter paneer banaya, jar banaya, the. चंगा लग so we now had our uh, break. Finally got chips that we all wanted. Go and has got a uh, sog. And the Jonas thing's eating uh, vegan stuff. And um, yeah, so how's the leg of the bean so far? Yeah, really good. We only chatted. I think we're going to rest here for a bit and then we'll go out again. Yeah, yeah. We'll have a little break, innit? Yeah. The rest of us are going to have a here as well again. Oh. It feels so nice. Oh. So now the weather has really lined up a bit. It's gone quite warm now, hasn't it? Like this morning we were just talking about how cold it was and the icy is like four or five degrees. Now the sun's out, atmosphere is getting really nice and warm. And we can actually hear the end of the Nugget Gid then, can't we? Yeah. And how can we hear Maharaj coming? We can hear through the Nagada, right? And that's one thing that we haven't got so far is the Nagada. So let's go take a look at the Nagada. What does it mean to you to do Nagada Seva? It's something that Shri Guru Gobind Singh Ji Maharaj gave to us. And I feel like we should be respected. We should respect it by playing it because we have to also remember the sacrifices our Shaheed Singh has made for us. So we must honour their memory and some of us even like to live the, the moment they did Amazing, back in the day. Man. Thanks bro. It's been really nice, really amazing. It's, it's really lovely. Part. What's been your favourite part? So my favourite part is being able to help out the Sangha. That's what I'm here for. I'm here to serve. Happy with Sangha here? You've been here since the start. Sorry? You've been here since the start. Yeah, I've been here since the start. How's, been, your, how's your day been? We've been very blessed. Jonathan Pilar has been very nice. It's been beautiful. beautiful. Happy with Sangha. Happy with Sangha as well. It's so beautiful to see as well. As you can see on my left hand side, the Sangat, they walk in front of Maharaji and they brush, brush the roads so that Maharaji and the bunch about it, they don't step on any stones or they don't get their feet hurt. So you can see here all the Sangat brushing the floor. 
hundreds of Sangat brushing the floor. Such a beautiful thing to see. And there was actually one Nagar Kirtan where I actually partook in the seva and it's not an easy seva to do. It's, it's literally back-breaking work. For maybe seven, eight hours, you're just brushing the floor, back arch, and you know, I touch the feet of every seva down here who has done this seva for the whole Nagar Kirtan. How many punch are there? Uh, four, five. <laughs> How's your get them, bro? It's beautiful. Uh, it's great to see first for Saki and I get them back since uh, post COVID, pre COVID. Um, beautiful to see, huge turnout. Um, otherwise, great day. Happy with Saki. <laughs> Just uh, spent the day um, with Maharaj Kirpa. I've been able to do seva uh, during the Nagar Kirtan uh, for Vasaki tw uh, 2023, and um, like to start by saying it's been a very like blissful experience for me personally. It's it's always a you know I think now I can really appreciate you know not just for myself but to, to serve the sangat is something that I, I really appreciate and I'm really thankful to uh, Maharaj for you know blessing me with this. Uh, the good fire was very been beautiful. It's been a real nice snow good ten. And uh, uh, with Waigu's blessings, it was, it was very nice. Yeah, so. yeah it's, uh, it's a beautiful experience uh, every time, and just nice to see all the Sangat get together, all the Seva does help now, and it's just a great experience overall. So we've just reached back to Park Avenue Gurdwara now. The good deed is finished now. It's such a blessed, blessed day. Yeah. Sun came out as well. Sangat was just vibrant isn't it? I think that's the word to use. So much love within the Sangha. Even a lot of conversation we had off off camera. 
a lot of conversation we had off camera was just blessed man yeah. uh, just to see all the good sakes around especially uh, and, and to see non niji non niji and all those beautiful good sakes there just really really made my day and to see all the hang sings all the fodja do their stuff as well it was just a great experience what, about, what do you think yeah it's, it's long awaited because it's been the first nagri kitan vasaki nagri kitan in about three years i think so it's yeah it's, it's yeah. A long awaited I, I think the sangat really appreciated it as well and there's a quite a buzz as well i feel back in south also and in in the, in the last stretch as well i i stood right next to the palki side mm -hmm. and i listened to the kitan for a while as well because i we didn't hear it for the whole day and it was just so much and on that you just stand there looking at Maharaji, singing Shabads, singing their praises and just look around and looking at people's faces with smiles on their faces. It, it was just a general mood of happiness and Nanda and George Dikra, right? So I think we should wrap up now. Yeah, wrap it up. Hope you enjoyed this vlogs. Make sure you like, subscribe and share. Thank you so much. Wahi Guti Ka Khalsa, Wahi Guti Ki Fadeh.